been hearing people ask about uh, plasma. So let's just do a nice casual plasma run and we can like kind of explore it together or what I've done or had success with. Uh, I think just like a black stake run is a good idea after uh, <laughs> doing the finishing a gold stake. The strat to play small hands at gold stakes. Uh, depends. Context is important. You want achievable hands if you're scaling or if you don't have hand fixing. My hand looks massive right now, I'm going to be honest with you. <laughs> it's very confusing. This is technically, like, funny positive. I think ballot is reasonable because, again, like, it gives us chip scoring. So ballot is often something that I am not inclined to pick up uh, as, like, my first joker. Unless I have a, I don't know, a good reason to. Uh, but because it gives us additional chips that flatten out, um, I think it's a little bit better here if we can position, like, high cards in a way that makes sense. So, like, here I'm not even necessarily, like... In a normal run, I would just snap pick the Lusty Joker. I say to myself, I need something to um, to beat the boss here. I think we can just get away with going next. Let the Econ roll over. We've got money um, as a result of our strength. And then just do something like this. It'd be really funny if I, <laughs> I'm doing this long explanation and just like flop the run. So something like Blue Joker, premium, premium pickup for uh, uh, for Plasma early. And then now we're just looking to. Okay, well, runs over. <laughs> we're looking for something to scale up. And then, uh, because multiplying a number is a lot easier to increase than um, <laughs> well met. than adding, eventually we want to find a, a nice big multiplier for something like this. This is how we can get the, the molt side to be a little bit more uh, in line with where we are with the, uh, the chips. Coldstone, thank you for the four months. I'm a little afraid that no matter what I do, it's going to clear. Yeah, we are very strong. But now we can leverage the strength again to fix our econ. We do not want half joker. Um, I'll take a buffoon pack though. Fix our econ and jeez. Find some more direction. Now, long term, I don't know how good Ramen is, just because we do need to discard to make sure we hit two pair. But, like, <laughs> it keeps us very strong right now. Ugh. I should have sold out of the ballot uh, so that I could get interest off of it. Speaking of interest. I want to run with two blue jokers, the minus two hand size, plus 300 chips, and a couple other jokers on plasma. Yeah. Uh, the minus, uh, or the stuntman is really, really good on, uh, on plasma. Um, last night, I took a, a stuntman run on gold stake to the final boss on the, uh, <laughs> the spectral deck. It was pretty funny. I don't want more discards right now. Uh, I do want more two pair scaling. There's also a holographic to the moon, so it could just kind of hang out for a bit. And as Callie astutely mentioned, <laughs> probably we'll just stay in our deck if we find the bowl. Right, the, uh, the ramen is falling off because I cannot find a second pair right now
I'm losing my mind. We're just not scaling here, I guess. Sometimes we'll be forced to play high card, I think. Yellow. Ho <laughs> uh, ho I mean, I might as well. Like, two pair is, uh, or full house is a form of two pair. Okay, can I get a second pair, please? Not exactly what I meant. <laughs> right, we are going to want a replacement for ramen. Okay. Uh, if this breaks, it could be a replacement for ramen long term. Uh, Mercury, sure. Again? Oh. Do I want tarot cards? I guess I might as well. Like, strength could be helpful for hitting two pair. Three of a kind, no thank you. Oh hey, we actually hit two pair. Ramen gives me anxiety. I think, um... Oh god, the banana's already gone. I relate to that. Like, I don't... I got it because it was good in that moment. I don't think it's, again, worth preserving as so much as uh, the spare trousers is worth investing in, you know? Okay. I only get one here. We do also probably want to consider adding cards to our deck um, or to make the blue joker a bit better. Uh, I don't have square joker anymore. What am I doing? I would love a square joker, though. Can we speak that into existence, maybe? Honestly, this pair is reasonably good. I need more chip generators. Let's do that. Just buy these spectral packs as well. We are flush with cash. There's Uranus. Uh, blank voucher gives you the... It, you have to buy it a few times to unlock it, but it gives you the opportunity to get a plus one Joker slot voucher. Um, this is my unlock all account or uh, profile, so it does have that available. So I'm just buying it for the opportunity to basically get a free Joker slot. Let's kill these two nerds and then discard everything here. On the bright side, we don't have to, like, get sad when ramen, uh, it's deleted now. So we can just discard freely like we need to anyway. I don't even have the voucher that guarantees this. What's going on? I'm just good at the game. pair already. Oh god, I shouldn't have played that too. Honestly, we're just cruising and I'm not even paying attention to what the boss is. Uh, let's keep the king. I haven't just... No, I don't have very many kings. Eights I have plenty of, so sure. That, well, no, I want to keep playing two pair for the uh, supernova, you know. I didn't need to play that extra. <laughs> or... I've learned nothing, chat. Uh, Jupiter? More like Poopiter. Got him.
Oh, baby. Never stop gambling, chat. Double our money. <laughs> eh? Why not? I deserve a treat. <laughs> What's wrong with you, video game? Super banana. It's in a pair. Unfortunately, this does give us more time to scale, but it also gives us more time to lose the banana. Okay, well, this is just outrageous. Time for chat to collectively turn into the characters from the Hit Illumination Studios film. Which one's that? Illumination Studios. Hermit? I could get more money. Banana? That's the name of a movie? Oh, Minions. Okay. Alright, we are in business right now. What are you? Useless? Cool. More tarot cards. It's scaling the this, but not, maybe that wasn't actually worth. Okay, let's delete the fours. Turn Ace into a glass card and hit the Emperor. Or even that actually ended up being worth because we hit the Emperor. I think it probably wasn't if we didn't. Let's go Molt cards here and Lucky card. Give me money, Lucky card. I deserve it. Nope. I haven't gotten lucky enough yet. Clearly. I don't need consumable slots, we're just kind of using them. There's that pooper again. There we go. I've gotten a lot of Uranus hits, I can't complain. Or, I shouldn't complain. Let's make the ace lucky. Surely with a lucky ace, the glass ace won't break, right? I don't think we need more scaling. We do need more of this, though. I think this unlocks a um, better voucher that could be beneficial, but... Uh, I don't think it's worth the money. Actually, let's make another steel ace and emperor again. Let's go next, keep our interest rolling over. Straight flush, no thank you. Is that a banana in your pants or are you just happy to see us? Why can't it be both? Who says it's not both? Go here. Wait, we hit the money. Oh my god, we hit the money on the lucky card. That's twenty dollars. <laughs> this might be the luckiest run I've ever had. I don't think we need that. Unless the banana breaks. Oh my god. You can't keep getting away with it! Uh, this can turn into an ace, but I don't want it to. <laughs> I need... There we go. We can turn this it and this.
Dong. I just love the satisfying ding with this deck. Bye. Bye. Uh, that was a tarot card voucher, right? Oh my god. Glass card. Uh, go Glass King. I don't care. Stop! This is not fair. Oh, this is the planet card one. That's disappointing. God, I'm so unlucky. Uh, death could help us make two pair. Let's, uh, kill this. And... How many eights are we? Uh, okay, eights and nines are the same, so we might as well get rid of the eight. Hey, there's Square Joker. It's probably too late in the run. I might play a full house from time to time. Probably not, though, because of the supernova. Okay, just keep giving me those tarot cards. I mean, I guess we might as well use this, but I don't like the hangman here. Everything in hand is looking pretty fine. No lucky card hit. I'm so unbelievably unlucky. Uh, I think I discard enough that that's not worth. I do want to, like, find standard packs. My deck is kind of small. I guess I've been hanged manning stuff, so the, <laughs> the blue joker is probably worth exploring a replacement for. I just don't think that replacement is necessarily the banner. Right, because this is still more chips after a discard. I have a lot of aces. I don't want to risk this being an ace. So I want to uh, keep the supernova going. I think it's better to go all in on red and drop chips. Yeah, I think at this point it's probably worth a look. Uh, I just need, like, a good option for that. Or just some flat molt or multiplicative molt. Death. Bring this over for another... Like, even the lucky card option could have been worth a look. But let's see what's in this box. That's kind of bad. Let's just buy this. We're gonna get our money rolling through, even though the game's almost over. Uh, early on, though, like we were talking, you definitely want to focus on chips, not molt. You just, like, early, if you invest in molt, you're just setting yourself up to fail, especially at higher. Um, I'll risk the, the glass card, especially at higher blinds. Like, obviously... Anything can win on black stake, right? But when you get to gold stake, it's a little things are a little different. We don't have the capacity to invest in that. This is good. Wasn't that stuntman? Yeah, stuntman's probably very bad, extremely bad for us because it makes it difficult to. Um, find two pair. Again, just because chips are really good early, they scale worse into the late game, right? Because you don't have the capacity to multi like get multipliers. Chips carry you through the early game with the Plasma deck. You need to eventually transition to something that makes you stronger. Hey, 
and I don't want to uh just go here uh, I don't want to give up my hand size and lose the capacity to make two pair with the uh, stuntman so stuntman would be a omega throw there Next round. Uh-oh. It's too bad that there's no way that I could have known that this were happening. That's a shame. Quite the boss to run into. I think I imagine it probably just selects the most played hand that you have. That would be my guess because I've seen it. I've pretty much always seen it. Only ch choose my best, my most played hand from memory, or maybe it's just most memorable when it selects my most played hand. Get me another Emperor. God. Still so unlucky. How many kings and queens are we looking at? Five kings. Uh, so I want to go king and jack. Cerulean Bell is kind of free with a two pair build because no matter what card it selects, you can play a two pair. Um, a fortunate draw. You have a lot of kings and aces, though. Well, this is a fortunate draw. Give me money. I deserve it. I've been a good boy. Oh, I got the 20 molt, didn't I? If you go to a collection that mentions it's always most played hand? Okay. Well, I guess Blue Joker does not get replaced here, right? Unless... Uh, is Odd Todd just better? I don't have a lot of queens. I think we just skip these and go next. Aces and queens? About not having those, uh, those queens, huh? So unfortunately, we do have to discard this. I want to keep the kings. Rid of the f sixes, sevens, for sure. And probably the eight as well, unless, yeah, eight and nine are the same. Gonna go for all the achievements? I mean, eventually. It's just like, achievements aren't a huge motivator for me. and never have been, so. I'm not in a big hurry to do so. There we go. Uh, let's just get that stone chip in there. Like, I do have a separate profile where I'm going through and doing the unlocks, but... Um, sometimes that feels tedious. Right. We keep it going. That's pretty good. I would love to get, like, a temperance. Because, again, somebody deleted all my money without telling me. I almost clicked reroll there on accident and wasted more of my money. <laughs> uh, I suppose we might as well discard to see if we can get to keep that gold card, yeah. I'm glad they gave you the option to unlock everything off the bat, though. Yeah, that was a huge, huge quality of life thing that you don't always see, but was very nice. I want this money. Give me money. Give money. Oh, I had the money. I discarded the coin. <laughs> it's been a long stream, okay? Got me some slack. I 
That's gotta be better than the blue joker now, right? It's because my molt is so high. What are the pants or the supernova? Supernova is at 31, this is at 62, and this is at 39. <laughs> Multiplier's good at this point. Uh, queen is gone. Probably get rid of the jack as well, but tens are still good. Nice of banana not to eat itself so far? Yeah, well, there's still time, don't worry. We just lost an ace. Honestly, a vampire would have been really, really good for this deck because we've generated so many, um, I mean, it's fun, right? Same rank, gold seal. I could fix my money. Put a gold seal on that ace. I want to play that lucky ace anyway. Uh, pairs mod check. There we go. I don't want. I don't want to stone any of these. Probably should just focus on like getting the hand that wins here. I could stone the stone card. Two kings, one jack. How many tens? I've oh, only one ten left. I've been kind of throwing. Uh oh. Speaking of throwing, king high takes it. Hey, see you later, Ben. Thanks for hanging out. I mean, we don't need that many points, right? Wasn't even close. The molt goes so crazy, it doesn't matter. Magician is lucky card. I'll take it. Two million should be attainable. Let's make a king lucky. not looking great. I don't have any of those steel cards in hand right now, so. Alright. That's fine. I was kind of tired of playing two pair anyway. But, uh, yeah. That's the plasma deck. Just, uh, chips early. Transition into something like this with once you start scaling your molt and it should be rather free.